What's going on with y'all, man? Welcome to Chris Buzzy Gears and Reviews. And as you can see from what's on the table, we got us something different today. I had to get me a new PlayStation 4 DualShock controller. Now, me, myself, I've been a gamer for years. I have no problem admitting that ever since I was young. Back when it was Super Nintendo, Sega Genesis. When I was dead broke, man, I couldn't picture this. <laughs> so I've been a gamer for a long time. Where I actually picked that tradition up from was actually growing up in South Baltimore, Maryland, Westport Projects. The stereotypical projects, like you really couldn't even go outside and fucking play because you might catch a stray bullet, that type of shit. South Baltimore, Westport Projects, man. If anybody from Baltimore who may watch this video, y'all can vouch for me, man. So my mother kept me in the house, man. So she kept me with a Super Nintendo, Sega Genesis, you know what I'm saying? So that's where I kind of picked up that tradition from. So I've been a gamer for a long time and I'm probably going to die a gamer. But with that being said, what really grinds my gears dealing with the PlayStation 4 is the fact that I've had my PS4 for about seven to eight years and I've literally had to go through five authentic PlayStation DualShock controllers. These controllers do not hold up. So what I did this time, I went to Walmart and I actually got me the two year protection plan. Y'all won't get me no more. Yep, I got the two year protection plan. So I'm going to go ahead and do is jump on that website, activate that protection plan, and hopefully I can get more than two years out of this controller. Because there's something about these PS4 controllers, coincidentally enough, they have a lifespan of about two years, <laughs> which just so happens to be what the protection plan is for. That's odd, ain't it? But I just kind of wanted to chime in and let y'all know, man, I had to get me a new PS4 controller. We got the uh, Woodland, Vietnam, Air, Camo. I like that. But yeah, man. It got so bad to the point where I was buying them cheap-ass Amazon controllers. The little knockoff PS4 controllers. I was just saying, I'm not spending no more $60 on a controller. So the last time I bought a uh, controller from Walmart, it lasted literally about two months. And it was lagging doing all kinds of shit and I was just like I'm not doing it no more I just get the cheap Amazon knockoff shit but today I decided to go ahead and get me an authentic controller let you take a look at it I really like that camo I done had all kinds I done had the red camo the gray camo two black ones PlayStation 4 controller So hopefully I can enjoy my Call of Duty Modern Warfare, my MLB The Show 21. I'm go ahead and jump back on that Battlefield 5. Start enjoying these games again. I just kind of wanted to chime in and let y'all know what we got. Man, I don't want to hold y'all too long. Man, I just kind of wanted to let y'all take a look at it. But that's it though, man. Y'all be blessed. Be safe. I'm off work today, so I'm about to go ahead and start putting some mileage on this controller right now.